The media often painted a harsh picture of Trump, particularly when he questioned the immigration policies of the United States. He famously asked why the US was letting people from shithole countries into the nation, a statement that, at the time, was widely criticized. Yet, fast forward a few years, and we find that Haiti, one of the countries he referred to, is now overrun by violent gangs. A cannibal gang leader has even risen to the presidency, leaving the previous president ousted and bodies rotting in the streets. Children, armed with AK-47S, have taken control, promising a grim fate to those who cross them. Trump's controversial remarks were rooted in a deep-seated desire to keep Americans safe. His primary goal as president was to protect American citizens, both at home and abroad. He made a point of ensuring the safe return of all Americans jailed or kidnapped in foreign lands. Contrast this with the Democrats who, in one instance, prioritized the release of a notorious arms dealer over a stranded Marine in Russia, all because a basketball player had smoked weed and the television personality disapproved of Trump. Trump's vision extended beyond immediate safety concerns. He aimed to rid the country of illegal immigrants and return to the traditional nuclear family structure. He believed that the rise in single parenthood, indicated by phrases like baby mama and baby daddy, was a contributing factor to societal decline. After all, many people in prison come from fatherless homes. How can a child learn to be a responsible adult if their father isn't around to guide them? The current administration, according to some, is a tyrannical stolen government. Accusations of the Democrats stealing the last election have been persistent, with claims of Barack Obama secretly running the country being rampant. The Democratic Party is also accused of leaving Iraq and Afghanistan armed to the teeth, creating a fertile ground for terrorists. The focus of the Democratic Party has seemingly shifted from important national issues to promoting gay marriage and allowing children to change their gender. There are calls to make it illegal for doctors to perform surgery on a child's genitalia or administer drugs to stop puberty. So, to wrap up, this video has explored Trump's controversial immigration remarks, his commitment to American safety, his vision of restoring the traditional family structure and the alleged wrongdoings of the Democratic Party. It's clear that there's a strong desire among many to regain control and steer the country back towards what they believe are its foundational values. Whether you agree or disagree, one thing is certain. These conversations are crucial for the future of the United States.